Hello everyone, and today I want to talk about again Swatch Omega Snoopy Watch because second one is coming out, and I don't want you guys waste time too much of chasing them and thinking there's possibly to get them. There is, and me and my friends we find it out. We find out how to get them, okay? Uh, because I've been on how many of these watch missions? Let's call them like that. I never get anything. After almost two years, what do I have to show for? Two watches. And the one I bought was Pluto, and the Moon Watch was actually a gift. So this one was a gift. So in years' time, I only was able to get one. But there's possibly to get them, okay? So stay tuned. Like a little treat right now. Ooh, what's that? I'm doing the Swatch store there. Swatch store. Oh, here we go. Uh, waiting for the launch of the Snoopy Omega Swatch. Light edition. Time now is about 2.30. We're, we're going for this one. We've got the white edition Snoopy. Ooh. This is the Moon Swatch Gold. So you're a big fan, huh? <laughs> So yes, lots of holding down the fort for 13 hours straight. That's how this video was pretty much created. So I brought some hot cocoa and crampets for them because they were running low on food supplies. And yeah, end of day, it was good night. Uh, they even end up in this amazing video, which is a bit surprised because there were so many people in front of us, about 20. So what can I say? Six attempts, uh, finally. Mission passed. No way! There's more! So people, riddle me this. If there's 15 people in front of us, why did we end up in the video? You could say the same answer as always, because some people are more photogenic than other ones, I guess. Well, and this is the case. So people, regarding the options. Well, option number one is as I like to call it, mission to eBay, or nice and easy. Personally, I do believe I pay enough in tax that I should not be supporting these unemployed people with their schemes of acquiring quick wealth. Anyone who waited in line uh, should have a fair chance of purchasing the goods from the store. They, they should not be discriminated. So for me, guys, it's the resellers. I'm not buying from them. I'm not breaking my morals. It's really not that deep. If I'm not getting the watch, I'm not getting it. Okay, it wasn't meant to be. Again, Snoopy watch looks amazing. The white one, I think it looks the best from every single Swatch Omega um, ones. I think it's the best looking one. But on that note, yes, it's not even about few people who just go there and they're like, we are resellers. They are like small PLC companies, which are doing like professionally they're dropping four or five people at each location in london so they're gonna scoop around what 15 watches per night but there is a way out guys okay so option number two option number two is actually beating them at their own game and this is how you do it this we, this is how we did it okay so let's jump into it so guys for you to obtain it you need to put down 100 percent commitment and the reason is, when you go and you see these resellers queuing up in the line or whatnot, half of them are not even there, okay? Half of them, they're buying Snickers, they're having a smoke, or they're just taking a visa around the corner, okay? So when you see like 10 people, it is actually 20. So you want to be in a first group of 20 people waiting outside to make sure you're going to get the watch. And when you're going there, you don't want to go on your own because... They do allow people to leave the queue for, let's say, about 45-50 minutes, but you need to be back every single hour because the security is taking pictures of you queuing up, so there's no, uh, you know, jumping the queue and stuff. So you want to have a few of your friends there. So I would suggest look at this as experience. Look at this like a once a flight time experience because you're not doing this monthly, you're not doing this yearly. Maybe you will never ever gonna queue up in your lifetime for this. So if you're going for this option, I would suggest to you make the best out of this situation. Get your friends there. Be prepared. If we are talking about London, be always prepared. It will gonna be raining at one point. 
foldable chairs, blanket, gloves, power bank, umbrella, and a good company. These are the things you really gonna need to make it through the night. Otherwise, it will gonna be way too boring, okay? And you need to make the best out of bad situation. And if you just have your preparations for it, it will gonna be so much better than just showing up and hoping for the best. And I think if you follow these kind of steps and you are well prepared, it's not gonna feel like such a do or die situation. So make the best out of the bad situation and make some good memories, some good stories to tell in the parties, how, hey, once I was waiting 15 hours outside of the store just to get Swatch Omega Watch. At least now you know the rules of the game and the scale of the game, and you can determine do you want to co commit yourself waiting in line for 15 hours? Is it worth to do it? I mean, it's all in your eyes. For me personally, if there would be another possibility to wait outside for the moon swatch, I wouldn't do it. I just wouldn't do it. I would say it's not that special for me to wait outside to get another one. Snoopy watch is a different story, but again, guys, it's all in the eyes of the viewer. So thanks, guys, for tuning in and uh, subscribe. Till next time, Mr. Zas out.